Tonight we're in Doncaster, and this is Question Time. Damn, what you think, baby? Don't give a damn, damn, don't give a damn, damn, don't give a damn. Welcome, whether you're watching on television, listening on the radio, to our audience and to our panel tonight. The Conservative, member of the European Parliament, one of the leading lights of the campaign to leave the EU, Daniel Hannan. Labour's Shadow Work and Pension Secretary, Owen Smith. The leader of the SNP at Westminster, Angus Robertson. The Green Party's only member in the House of Lords, Jenny Jones. I'm not that keen on chicken. And from the Taxpayers' Alliance, Dia Chakrabarti. <laughs> Let's have our first question. It comes from Jason Leeson, please. Jason? Yeah. On a scale of 1 to 10, how genuine is Jeremy Corbyn's newfound support of the EU? Ladies <laughs> and gentlemen, the judges' scores. Craig Revel Hall. One. Lendon. Five. Yay! Alicia Dixon. Four. And Bruno Tognoni. Three. <laughs> We'd have been fed a load of rubbish by the media for 20 years. Uh, I think the quote from Rupert Murdoch saying that he wants to leave the EU because in Downing Street he gets listened to and they do what he says and in Brussels he gets ignored. It's very telling of why The Sun and the other media are against the EU. Yeah. <laughs> if, if, he get, if, he gets listened to, if he gets listened to in number 10, why is the Prime Minister staying in, not voting for Brexit? Well... <laughs> why do people pro in? Hear from somebody who's in favour of out. Raise your hand. Just, oh my God. <laughs> yeah, are you going to you? Yes, you. Not to be racist or anything, but... I don't believe our country's free anymore. You only have to look at the European Union and what's going off there. I want my country back. I want Britain to be Britain. I'm sorry. Well, if, I, if we come out of the European Union and I want to work in France, if I've got the skills, they'll let me work in France. Why do I have to win the European Union for that? Oh, Bougodan! You, you seem to have got your passport there. You don't need yeah. a passport for Doncaster. <laughs> no, I, I, I actually was so desperate to come to your debate that I flew in from Strasbourg to do it. But... I thought... You sound the th uh, third row there in the blue. Yeah. I, I, my big worry is we're creating a very selfish and insular society. This idea <laughs> that tax in any shape or form is wrong and as you Ooh, might have said you know we need these things to pay for the NHS we need these things to pay for schools we need these things to pay for benefits <laughs> my worry is we should be looking at tax as more of a moral obligation yeah. than a legal obligation the one, the one up there we expect, yes that's you yes yeah, I find the question for Doncaster, really, that question that was posed, quite ironic because I see lots of women, my friends, like myself, who's going to lose my job in two weeks' time because the Tories have been stealing our tax and, domest and, and domestic violence services are closing. Women's Aid is closing in two weeks' time. It's been here for 40 years. Mm -hmm. And it's closing because the Tories... It's all because... No, just but explain what you mean. Because yeah, of the Tories doing what, exactly? Well, the, the, what we talk about, the Panama Papers, what everybody... It's mm. like almost the elephant in the room. The question about uh, inheritance tax is, is a small issue. The question of Google and Boots and, uh, you name it, Starbucks. The question of Tories. I don't know how you dare talk about um, Europe being corrupt. When we have Cameron, who said that he would look after the vulnerable in 2010, mm. and he has stripped us of everything, yeah. and this town. Is well, well, okay. All right. I mean, I I'd like to get back to the original question at some stage, but since you say it's, it's not reasonable to link it to Europe, all right. Between, it's according boring. to the Institute for Fiscal Studies, between 2010 and 2015, during the coalition parliament, all of the austerity cuts put together 
saved £36 billion. So you're a liar! You're a liar! You're a liar! It's a lie! During that period... No, 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 during that period... Yeah. Sorry, ma'am. No, 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 we know that we have been played by an ultra-rich elite in this country uh -huh. and around the world who fiddle their taxes, who salt it away in tax havens, and this government says that the biggest problem when it comes to the abuse is the abuse of benefits. To all of you who came to, to Doncaster tonight to take part, many thanks. And until next Thursday from Question Time, good night.